the year of 2022 was definitely one to remember in the context of volcanoes. Not only did the Mauna Loa volcano in Hawaii end a 38-year-long eruption drought, but in addition, a volcano in the nation of Tonga produced Earth's largest volcanic eruption since at least 1991, potentially even longer. In Italy, we got to witness a small tsunami be generated by a pyroclastic flu, while in Iceland, the Reckonis Peninsula was the site of its second volcanic eruption in two years. This video will discuss the most remarkable moments in the world of volcanoes during 2022. Starting with the most notable event of 2022 in the world of volcanology was the events which occurred at the previously little-known Hunga Tonga Hunga Haapai volcano. As of 2008, this volcano consisted of two separate islands, Hunga Haapai to the west and Hunga Tonga to the east. However, over the next several years, volcanic eruptions which were moderately explosive joined these two islands. Another such moderately explosive eruption began in late December of 2021, and not much was initially thought of it. Then, on January 14th of 2022, an unusually powerful explosion occurred at the volcano. This generated unusual currents on the populated island of Tongatapu to the south, which was interpreted as a small-scale tsunami. Then, the following day, the unthinkable happened. The volcano violently exploded in a force which in a scientific paper was estimated to be equivalent to the detonation of 25 million tons of TNT, immediately destroying a large part of the island. This created the tallest eruption plume ever recorded, which shot to a height of as much as 58 kilometers or 190,000 feet into the atmosphere. Although the size of the eruption which occurred on that day is still uncertain, it definitely had a volcanic explosivity index rating of either a moderate to upper end 5 or a lower end 6. This eruption would go on to cause highly unusual sunsets in the southern hemisphere. The following month, on February 10th, the famed Etna Stratovolcano in Italy put on a spectacular show via paroxysm, which sent lava fountains to a height of more than 550 meters or 1,804 feet into the sky. This provided a fantastic contrast in coloration of the black sky and orange molten rock. In August of this year, I traveled to Iceland to witness the newest eruption of the Fagradalsviak volcano. This effusive eruption was spectacular to visit, and I could truly describe it as an experience I will never forget. I even filmed some videos on site revealing my face. In October, at the Stromboli volcano, which had been erupting for some time, part of its active crater wall collapsed, which fell down the volcano's steep slopes, generating pyroclastic flows. These pyroclastic flows then flowed into the Mediterranean Sea, traveling a short distance before halting, and due to their displacement of water, generating a small-scale tsunami which is being shown on screen. In Hawaii, the Mauna Loa volcano produced an episode of unrest which continued into late November. This eventually culminated in a new volcanic eruption, sending lava flows into its northeast rift zone, which then subsequently flowed towards a major road on the island. Luckily, the lava would not reach this road, as the eruption would eventually end. Thanks for watching my Geology Hub YouTube channel during 2022, and I would like to thank this channel's patrons on Patreon and channel members on YouTube.